it's a test that Yaron and I have been working on for about three years now for the diagnosis of urinary tract infections. But we realised fairly early on in the current pandemic that it was completely applicable to uh, detecting COVID-19 as well. And then we read a couple of publications where other groups had been thinking along similar lines. So we took their ideas and kind of modified them for our own test and quickly got involved with NHS and the local health board uh, and have been able to um, develop the test, optimise the test and evaluate its performance in a really short space of time. We're currently again working with the local health board to evaluate the performance of our test without sample processing directly from the swab uh, to show that that can perform as well as the official tests. The first stage we're doing, the swabbing will happen and we'll be still run the test within our lab. But in the longer term, if it means that we can actually run the test within the community, that's going to be very, very important. After the lockdown, we still need to be able to find out where the hospitals are. We still need to be able to be confident that people working in care settings uh, are, are safe. We already have a prototype that we've been developing for the last couple of years, so we have that to test, and we're in talks with local uh, manufacturing and design companies about making more of those prototypes. So it is realistic to think that within two or three weeks we can have the first prototype ready for proper testing in these settings, and then scale up after that really depends on, on how quickly we can get these things optimised and manufactured. One of the things that drives me is, is this desire to make a difference, and uh, I really feel like science can do that, but a lot of the time it doesn't quite get there. A lot of the normal barriers that are there are just not, and everyone's being really supportive and working together and collaborating to try and answer this one massive global problem we have at the moment. I wish science was like this uh, all the time, because it shows how much you can achieve in such a short space of time.